I've witnessed others who didn't appreciate you, value you, or love you. They certainly didn't love you as you needed to be loved. They didn't see you, they didn't hear you, and they took you for granted and they lost in the end. While you hurt in those moments, I knew it was temporary. God had someone in store for you, but you just had to climb a few mountains. You made it to the top of the mountain that matters most, and behold, Torian was there. Uh, the one thing I can't say I remember in this courtship, in this marriage, was the day I was sitting at home, he calls me, he goes, Mom, what you doing? I said, nothing, what's up? All he said to me was, I found her. I was like, really? He says, yes. Of course I lost it. Knew what he was talking about, but didn't know who or anything, no details. But that's what he said to me, he says, I found her. And immediately I started playing. Do you old schoolers know, Mama, I found that girl. I started playing that over and over. I said, oh my gosh, I wonder who she is. She must be something else. So I just want you to know you are something else. First thing I told them was this thing called WYSIWYG, which is what you see is what you get. And to let them know that don't try to change each other accept each other the way they are and just love each other and hold on to each other and as long as long as torian puts melanie first and melanie puts torian first it all will go So Brittany and I have been Torian's best friend for roughly 15, 16 years now. Yes. <laughs> and I have to say, I have never seen him more happy in his life. Seeing him go through a lot and you make him really, really happy. And I'm so happy. <laughs> Thank you so much for loving my dad. Do the best that you guys can to make each other happy. Keep everybody out of your business. Melanie, take care of my brother. Torian, take care of your wife. Congratulations to you both.